Okay, here's how you reconcile a row. Go on the tablets, click reconcile. It'll ask you to reconcile a row first. You could do the whole yard or you could do this section by section. Obviously, I think we're gonna be doing section by section because to do the whole yard is a mission. But we should probably do this pretty often. I'm gonna do row four, okay? Scan to row four. So every barcode I scan on these cars, they're supposed to be in row four. Here's row four, it's probably our smallest row, that's why I'm doing this. Take the gun, scan it. On to the next one. I'm not gonna do everything on purpose. I'm not gonna do the whole section just to show you what happens if let's say someone grabbed a car out of inventory and oops, we forgot to tell the front we junked the car. Okay, so I'm gonna only do boom, 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 one, two, three. I'm gonna leave all these over here, not scanned in at all, and just show you the report. But in theory, you would scan all everything in row four and make sure everything in row four is one, it's supposed to be in row four, and two, complete. So if there's any missing cars, we should know about it too. I'm gonna take this car in row two, even though it's in row two, it's in the right spot, it's not in row four, but imagine if this car was in row four and we were doing this process. So let's say, in theory, Gabino picked up a car, moved it for somebody, put this in a different row, and now we got a car that's supposed to be in row two actually in row four and uh this is the process how to figure that out our next step we're gonna transmit the data that we just did on our reconcile even though it's wrong but that's what we wanted to do we wanted to see when it's wrong and when it's right and what the difference is so we got to take our data that we just scanned in and send it to um send it to our system so we have four car four cars scanned in with reconciliation locations data you don't not let get uploaded for so what we gotta do is upload just click on upload upload data and uploaded cool so we're gonna close out that was on the tablet by the way but I think you guys know that um, start fresh here and we are going to reports it's a 200 inventory reports I had no idea these were out even here until today um, but this is the reconciliation report we're looking for we could do if we tried to reconcile the whole yard we could do it by today we could do it by a date range of reconciliations. We're gonna do it by specific uploads because I was messing around with this a little bit already. And we're just gonna look at the upload from 5.13, so that was a few minutes ago. I'm gonna select that upload and click on view reports. And of course, it's not coming up. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe I forgot to switch, select something. But here's our report. And I wanna show you guys it. What you could do is take this report and I'll print the report. Just bear with me, it's printing. All right, so here's a report. Remind you, row four is the smallest. It's, I don't know, maybe 10, 15 cars there. But this is what you want. We scanned one, saying we scanned one. It was in row four. It's supposed to be in row four. Good, good. Scanned another one in row four. It's supposed to be in row four. Good, good. Now it's saying we scanned one into row four. 
but it's actually in the yard as row two. What's going on with that? So we could either say, hey, well, is that in the right spot? Is it actually in row four and we could move it? In this case, I manually went to row two and said it was in row four. Even though that's not the case, I just want to show you how it looked on this reconciliation report in case someone moved the car from row two into row four. And it pops on the report, which is what you want. So it's saying reconcile failed on that one, no good. Now, what I also want to show you was this bottom part. So when you do a reconciliation, you're supposed to scan an, ent an entire row at the very least, if not the entire yard. We scanned it by rows. I said I scanned the entire row four. However, it's saying we have all these other cars in row four. It's, you didn't scan them. What's going on? Are these cars still here? You know, are they junked? So even though they're there, I just didn't scan them. Let's say they weren't there, then these would be popped and brought to our attention. They're either in a different part of the yard or they got junked and they weren't taken out of the system. So the reconciliation function is really important. We might be able, we sh should probably do different sections, different days, so it doesn't become all time consuming, but keep track of what sections are done on what days and uh, really use it to keep up with uh, sections. It's gonna be a really helpful tool to keep us uh, accurate. All right, thanks guys.